start from the scapular movements, we will start with the scapular elevation. We can apply the manual syntax as well for the scapular movements from different starting positions, either from sitting, from supine lying, or even from side lying. We will perform it here from sitting. Okay. Uh, you can also apply it bilaterally by placing your hands uh, over the shoulder, so superior to the uh, shoulder. Okay, and it's really important to be uh, higher than the uh, client or model to take a better advantage from your uh, body weight. Okay, uh, now both hands will apply resistance downwards, and I will ask him to elevate his shoulder upward to perform scapular elevation. Now you can go, relax. If you are applying the uh, strengthening exercise through the available range, this is dynamic strengthening exercise. If you are applying the uh, resistance and holding that resistance, then you are applying isometric contraction. And now we will apply manual resistance exercise for the scapular depression. Again, you are applying this from a uh, sitting position, but sitting at the edge of the bed. Um, you will uh, grasp the uh, palm of the uh, model, and I also will, um, I can stabilize the shoulder upward. Uh, the uh, resistance coming from this hand, okay? So I will apply the resistance upward and simply we will depress the scapula downward toward the ground, okay? Now, you will uh, go downward with your arm, go, okay, relax. Uh, if you are applying through the range, uh, it will be dynamic exercise. This was more like um, isometric contraction because I apply the resistance at the end of the range and hold uh, that resistance. A manual resistance exercise for the scapular protraction and retraction uh, setting, um, and I will uh, apply it now by that ready. I will put both hands anterior to the shoulder in order to resist the protraction of the shoulder, and the order will be try to bring your shoulder anteriorly, and to, uh, I will be giving the resistance. Go. Relax. Uh, applying the resistance through the range, this is dynamic strengthening exercise. Holding the resistance with the isometric contraction. Now, I will uh, change the placement of, the, of my hands. Uh, I will put them posteriorly, okay, posterior to the uh, uh, scapula, in order to apply resistance for the retraction of the scapula. Now, you need to bring both shoulders backward. Go. Relax. And then you need to repeat. 